The Gateway Mission is serving more than a thousand people in need this Thanksgiving. They've been doing this for the last 20 years. 13 on your side's Carla Byron is live at Hope College's DeVos Fieldhouse, who is a partner in this event. And Carla, looks like the doors have just opened. Yeah, lots of people trickling in and joining the many volunteers who are already seated here at the tables. You know, it's expected to be a full house. The Gateway Mission hopes to serve just over 1300 people here tonight, including people from their shelters, low income families, or even those who are just looking to spend the holiday with others. Linda Furbush is one of over 400 volunteers making the Holland Mission's great Thanksgiving banquet event happen. I have had a blast. It has been awesome. All the people here, volunteers are just fantastic. They're fun to work with. As a first timer, she baked two pies and helped set up all of the tables for the more than 1300 guests expected this year. So it just gives me joy, it makes me happy to know that what I did today to me is, I'm not gonna say it's nothing, but it's minimal to what it's going to, how it's going to affect them. The mission has been planning for this big event since the summer. The food, including 100 turkeys, have all been donated by the community and local companies. Pies have been donated, turkeys. I mean, if you can name it at a Thanksgiving meal, we've had people helping with it. What makes this event special is people from all different economic levels and backgrounds connecting. We've had volunteers in the past that have told us they've built a relationship with someone that they met at the banquet, that they've done future Thanksgiving meals and holiday meals with those individuals. So it's really an opportunity for our community to come together and to be united and to give thanks. In addition, they're offering more than 300 to go meals for people unable to physically make it out as well as for first responders. Uh, all I can say is if you're watching this next year and you think about volunteering, even if it's a couple pies or, you know, whatever, it's always needed, always wanted. No one is ever going to be turned away to volunteer. So another thing that the mission is doing this year is they're handing out these care boxes that have uh, products in them like hygiene products and other items that cannot be bought using uh, using the uh, food stamps. So uh, they are they will be handing out one per household and the mission expects that this event is going to be wrapped up by 7 730 tonight reporting live in Holland. Carla Byron 13 on your side.